hello and welcome back to TechFab YouTube channel so today in this video we are going to have a look on idle virus so the, the full name is idle body virus and if you have got this virus recently uh, this virus is a malware file uh, which is part of malicious idle body trojan uh, that seeks to use the system resources of your PC for illegal cryptocurrency mining in the background so you don't know that your computer is uh, using for illegal activities in the background if you have got this virus and in this video I'm going to help you out uh, with the removal process and I will let you know how it affects your computer and so let's get started to the video uh, first of all we need to remove this virus from the computer and uh, for that we need to check uh, the C drive where uh, this uh, uh, program or application resides and uh, you need to go onto the C drive and there you will find a folder called programming files and if you also got programming files x86 you need to check both the folders so in my case I do have programming files only click there and you will find the folder of Edelbody there and here we go so this is the folder what you need to do is you need to right click there and you need to delete this folder from there so this is the first step which you need to perform and after that close this and now go on to the search bar and type appwiz.cpl and once you will click on there and you will it will redirect you onto the control panel and you will get the programs here I have already deleted it so you will find Edelbody extension there idle body application there you just need to right click on there and then you need to install uninstall that software from there and if you are not getting that uh, software basically sometimes uh, it redeems uh, the name so that you can uh, find it uh, so you, ca you you cannot find it from there so what you need to do is you need to check the date uh, for example if your virus has been occurred today so you need to check all the softwares which has been installed today and you need to remove them all if you have not installed those softwares so this is the best way to recognize the malicious software and then you need to uh, remove that software from a uh, control panel and once you did that you need to close it down again and after that you need to perform some more actions uh, like you need to go on to the Google Chrome or whatever browser you are using and then you need to click on three dots and you need to click on settings and after settings you need to scroll down a bit and you will find let me have a look you will find extensions there okay now uh, what you need to do is here you can find the name extensions click there and you will find a lot of extensions there and you need to remove all those extensions which you don't know that you are using so for example if this is the uh, if this is the extension I'm not I'm not using you can just remove those uh, extensions from there and sometimes uh, it's just building one more extension there and you don't know what actually it is so you can just remove that application from this from there and after that after doing this one uh, what you need to do is you need to scan your computer with the legitimate antivirus so don't use any crack versions don't use any free versions as this is the main cause of getting those types of viruses on the computer so you need to uh, remove this you need to scan your computer with the legitimate antivirus and uh, after scanning the computer you need to quarantine all the uh, all the viruses and then you can restart your computer and you will get rid of this virus so this was the video for today and hopefully you enjoy the video if you love the video uh, subscribe and uh, hit the bell icon